Welcome back to the channel, my friends. Uh, pretty crazy title and thumbnail, I know. We're actually gonna do it. If you guys don't know, James Charles had this huge reveal of his uh, makeup palette. I don't know the first thing about makeup. I don't even know if it's like, what in particular this is. He made a lot of cool like art on his face. So I'm not totally sure how he did those things, but I'm gonna try. No hate or disrespect towards James Charles. The dude is super successful, obviously a hardworking person. So I respect that completely. I am gonna have fun with his makeup palette, which by the way was sold out. I bought this on eBay for like 80 bucks and then it got restocked in Ulta for like $39.99. So I got ripped off a little bit. Haley told me I was supposed to get brushes. So I went to Target and got some. Uh, I think he had some, but they're like $100 or something. And I just wasn't willing to do that, you know? If you haven't seen the commercial, here's a little more insight as to what the commercial actually was. It was like 45, 50 seconds. So I'm gonna play a little clip. I need to remake that song that he has going on in the background. That seems relatively easy. It's just like a bunch of repeating things with some yeah! You laughing at me over there, dude? And then I'm gonna have to do the makeup looks. Throughout, I'll just be filming the clips required for the commercial, and then at the end, we'll piece it together. So this this is probably gonna be the biggest like test that I've done on my channel. It should be a big experiment, but I'm excited. It should be pretty fun. So I don't really need to open either of these packages just yet, but I will make the song. And here's the thing. I have never used any like music software before. So. What's going on? What is going on? Um, is, that, is this the time? Um, okay, everyone, so the first thing that James does in this song that he made is this. So we're gonna do that real quick. Ready? Here we go. <clears throat> that was a little aggressive, I think. Nice, nice, nice. You killed that. Yeah, thanks, bro. Do you know how to cut stuff on there? Probably zoom in. Okay, so now we have that whole layer of just the Let's see what he does next. Doom, 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 doom. You think James Charles made the track? Apparently he did. Let's try this. <laughs> I'm just gonna roll with it. I think that works. Great, okay, let's see what else I need to add. Oh! I'm not claiming to be a singer, but <laughs> I'm not claiming not to be. So, boom. Boom. Yeah, yeah, oh yeah. Hey, 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 hey. That was angelic. What you laughing at? <laughs> so bad, dude. Hey. Hey, I couldn't do any better. I was kind of on tempo, though. Doesn't no matter how sh you sound. Hey, dude. All right guys, so just finished this song. It took us about 30 minutes. We're gonna listen to it now. Uh, James Charles Morph Reveal featuring Ryan Tran. I think the song's done. I'm gonna export that sucker and we should be ready to bounce. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. But. All right, this is gonna be the first part of the, the ad. This is the first look that we're going for. Uh, he has some hearts on his stuff. I'm just gonna grab, I don't know like what brush is, is the best. So I'm just gonna grab one. Uh, this one looks pretty overall good. It's pretty small, but it should do. So here's James Charles' palette. I'm gonna remake this look now. Ooh. Dude, I'm kind of scared. This is kind of crazy. There it is. Dude, that stuff. That stuff's matte. <laughs> Dude, that's kind of hard. Ah, dang, I look awesome. No look. No look. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. I see why people do makeup now. This is kind of awesome. I think we need this glitter one a little bit. Should I throw a little pink in there? It tastes like funny. You're not supposed to put it in your lips. Dude, what? I'm going to get a smaller brush and draw, heart, draw hearts on. We're going to do some white. So. 
All right, there we go. All right, so on the left is the look that James achieved, and here is my version. I licked my lips. There's stuff on it. Do I just wash my face in between or what? Is it coming off? No. We should have gotten makeup wipes. Do you think I can use, like, the Clorox wipes? No! Dude, it's worth a shot. Not on your face, bro. I just want to see if it works. All right, guys, so I got all the makeup off. Next up, we have this look, which is, like, flames, which is pretty sick. That doesn't look too hard. Oh, yeah, now it's showing up. A little flame right there. Some more orange. This looks pretty good. I don't know if it looks different in the viewfinder than it does like in real life, but this ain't looking bad. I'm not gonna put too much under my neck and stuff because it's kind of hard to clean. Looks like he has some on his eyes as well, so put that there a little bit. He has it under his eyelid as well. Under. Okay. This actually looks pretty good. Hold on, I got some orange on my lips. Orange on my lips. I can't tell if I look like James Charles or like a SoundCloud rapper. So this is James Charles look and this is mine side by side. This is probably more accurate than the other one at least. You know, the flames look good. All right, ready? Okay, so I got all the makeup off. I'm looking pretty awful right now. <laughs> the next look is the coolest look to me. It's the honey one. So it's where he's got the honeycomb like on the side of his head and then he's got the honey dripping. I bought some honey just so we can do this. It was like $5, so I hope it looks decent. I'm just gonna kind of freehand it like I have been. I don't really know anything about makeup, but it seems like this stuff is like pretty like, colorful on the face. It shows up pretty well, so that's good. Good job. Ryan. Makeup. For real. Well, first I'm gonna put the yellow in the eyes. I feel like people are gonna get mad at me for not using different brushes, so I'm gonna use a different brush, actually. Ooh, this one's gonna be really good for the honeycombs. All right, let me get some orange. Ooh, yeah, there we go. Bro, it's crazy how James Charles made this shit look good. Dude, mad respect. I mean, mine doesn't look half bad right now. I think he's using this color for the base of the honeycombs on the side. So I'm just gonna do a whole kind of, you know, foundation of that. Oh, yeah, there we go. And a couple right there. So now we have a good foundation for the honeycombs. So I'm gonna use this small little brush for the for the details on the honeycomb. The hardest shape to draw, are you kidding me? Because I'm busier than a bee. At this point I'm just drawing any shape I can. <laughs> it's definitely a triangle. Oh, that's some, that's some real honey right there. This stuff's organic. So he just, literally, does he just pour it on himself? I don't want it to like spill everywhere. Oh, we gotta be quick, we gotta be quick. Oh. Oh. <laughs> My face is literally getting destroyed by this. <laughs> This is the look that we're gonna go for in the next one. This one, I think, is relatively easy. I mean, the honeycomb one is probably the most difficult one that we're gonna have. So I think I'm gonna start with a green base, a dark green base. Oh, why didn't I do this before? Okay. Really out here unleashing my inner artist. I think it got in my eye. No, oh my god, the lips again. I didn't see any <laughs> lipstick included in the James Charles collection. If it wasn't supposed to be on our lips, then he would have included lipstick. <laughs> It looks like he added uh, some white and black accents to his uh, to his greenery. So that's what we're gonna do. All right, sisters. <laughs> Literally, it's just an outline. <laughs> it makes my lips look bigger. <laughs> <laughs> All of my brushes are dirty, so I can't really use the white. But let's film the clip for it. Oh, oh, oh. God, my skin is falling off. Jesus. I'd be surprised if I wake up with skin on my face tomorrow. <laughs> this one looks pretty easy. Uh, looks like a pink base. Don't even have to open my eyes for this one. Yep, looks good. So that's what I thought. Just a bunch of hues of purple, it looks like. I'm using this whole palette, by the way. Oh, this is by far the best. It's starting to burn a little bit, but I need some sort of like dark purple. Dark purple. It looks like he uses this purple glitter one quite a bit, so throw that in. And I just gotta put this on my lips. <sighs> so I cleaned, I cleaned a brush, so I'll be able to use it for the white on this one. Okay, so there we go. Now it's working. Dude, you can't lie, this one is looking good. Okay, so this is my look, and this is James Charles. He's a, I think this, would you say this is my best one, though? No. What is my best one? Flames. Flames was good. Flames. All right, let's film this part. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> burns. Everything burns. Face just burns a lot. Oh, this bubblegum clip is literally one second, and I'm doing it. I really respect all the work he went, he put under this, like. <sighs> It already looks like I put the pink stuff on because my face is so f All right, so this is the look that we're going for. The only problem is I don't have any bubble gum, so I'll have to figure something out there. It literally looks like just pink stuff. Frick, it's just supposed to be pink. <laughs> Dang it. Screw it, let's do it. Whoa, that's kind of a, that's kind of a bar. My face burns in so many ways right now. Okay, oh, I wanna itch my face, but I can't get rid of this masterpiece. My inner artist hates me. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. My face burns so bad. All right, guys, last but not least, I'm gonna be doing the iconic James Charles palette. Dude, how does he get the white to be like so apparent? Lots of layers, you think? <sighs> he must have used this entire like white color. 
This is gonna be pretty cool. This is not looking bad. Oh, there we go. Now I just need to do the like eyes. Looks like he has like every color on his eyes. All right, so. All right, there it is. I'm done. All right, guys, so this is the final look. Um, James Charles will be on the side. Let me know what you guys think I did the best job on. I'm gonna finish filming this last clip and then we're gonna go on to the final commercial. everyone that's the end of the video I hope you enjoyed the commercial that I put together not quite up to James Charles standards I will be the first to admit it I'm sure I made so many people upset with the makeup I honestly don't know what I'm doing and it really made me realize how much work goes into that stuff it really did so I totally respect that I respect the heck out of that anyways thanks for spending a little bit of time with me today Maybe not the best use of your time, I'll be honest, but um, if you like the video, please drop a like so I just feel a little bit better about my face because it's completely messed up right now. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Join the Gamer Squad. Am I, am I going with this? Should I do the Gamer Squad or no? Because some people are starting to call themselves gamers. It's, I don't do any gaming videos. I guess it's kind of funny. Anyways. Find me on Instagram. If you're interested, I have two companies in the description. One is a company where we focus on substitutes for single-use plastics. This is the Neptune bottle. And also the other one is a clothing line, Hydra, which I was wearing the hoodie for the current round, round six, like throughout the video. I'm not even kidding, it's 4.30 a.m. right now. I had to wait a while just so my face could like clean up a little bit. Uh, I took a shower and everything. It's feeling a little better, still hurts a little bit. But I'll be fine, I'll be fine. Um, <clears throat> Thanks for watching. Unleash your inner artist. Peace out. Bye bye. No. Dude, it's worth a shot. Not on your face, bro.